Well, 40 of our loved ones, our friends, our families, our co-workers, that's the number of recorded deaths due to COVID-19 in Duval County yesterday. 40 people died, but the numbers need some context. On your side, Troy Kless joins us live now, and he spoke with the doctor about what these numbers mean in the fight here on our first coast against this pandemic. Yeah, Jeannie, whether it's 40 people in Jacksonville among the 400,000 plus people that have died across the country due to coronavirus, all of those losses weigh heavily on healthcare workers like those here at UF Health. Now, one doctor I spoke with says that there are some inherent delays in the reporting process because they sometimes have to take time to confirm if someone did die from COVID or from another illness. Dr. Shirag Patel says the COVID fatigue among healthcare workers is real. It is taking a toll on all of the healthcare workers who are putting in extra hours um, and making the sacrifices that, frankly, we all signed up to make, uh, but it does come at a cost. Dr. Patel is the assistant chief medical officer at UF Health and says the reports of 40 COVID-19 deaths in Duval County on Tuesday is a concern. Regardless of the number of deaths you're going to hear, I mean, that's a punch in the gut. We reached out to the Duval County Health Department asking for more details about Tuesday's reported deaths. A city spokesperson tells First Coast News the reporting of those deaths in a single day was because of a large data upload. Sometimes we'll also verify that in fact this is what happened um, because we, we don't want to be misrepresenting what's going on with COVID. Um, you know, it, it's already significant enough. There's, there's no intent on anyone's part to inflate numbers, uh, but we want to be accurate in how we're reporting um, causes of death. He says that while getting the vaccines are the first step in getting out of this pandemic, he says it's important for people to continue following guidelines to minimize the spread. Beyond COVID, he says less people are going to see doctors and says unaddressed health issues may make contracting COVID worse. If you need medical care, seek medical care. That's what we're here for. Please don't ignore a problem which could turn into a, a bigger issue if it goes unattended to. And we actually just got a response from the uh, D D Duval County Department of Health, and they say that there hasn't been a rise of COVID-19 cases in Jacksonville, but all around the country. And they say that with that being the case, a rise in COVID deaths is expected, and they say that the numbers are accurate and reflect what happened on Tuesday. In total, 857 people in Duval County have died due to COVID-19, according to the Department of Health. We're live at UF Health. Troy Kless, First Coast News, on your side. Yeah, that's a lot of families missing the people they love. Thanks, Troy. COVID